guys, Aubrey here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 5, Module 2, Lesson 6 homework. So let's get started. Number 1, draw an area model. Then solve using the standard algorithm. Use arrows to match the partial products from your area model to the partial products in the algorithm. Alright, so again, like I always say, one of the most important things when doing a math problem is understanding the problem itself. So an area model. So in the previous lesson, we were starting to use area models to help us with standard algorithms. So A, we have 27 times 36. So our area model would look something like this. What does it look like? You can just draw it like that. So 27, you break it apart into 20 and 7. We can split it in half. Times 36. We do 36 and split it in half too. And it's very important that we set it up this way. We have to set up like 36, 30 on the bottom, 6 on top. We can't do it the other way around. It has to be like this. So now we multiply 6 times 20. 6 times 2 is 12 and add the 0. 6 times 7 is 42. 30 times 20, 3 times 2 is 6, and add the zeros. And 3 times 7 is 21, and add the zero at the end. So now let's multiply using standard algorithm. 7 times 6 is 42. And now 2 times 6 is um, 12, but plus 4 is um, 16. Alright, so if you look at our area model, we have 120 and 42. Now we add those together... 120 plus 42 is 162, and this matches the number over here on our standard algorithm. So that's what we did with our area model. Now let's move on to 27 times 30. We add a zero at the end for the 30. 7 times 3 is 21, and 2 times 3 is 6, plus 2 is 8, 810. Now let's look at the bottom half of our area model. 600 plus 210 equals 810. So this also matches the 810 here in our stand standard algorithm. The next step here would be to add 2 plus 0 is 2, 6 plus 1 is 7, and 1 plus 8 is 9. So our answer to 27 times 36 would be 972. All right, let's look at B now. We have 527 times 36. Let's make our area model. 527, that'll look like 500 plus 20 plus seven. We can split this into thirds because we have 520 and seven, that's three numbers. And then times 36, remember 30, on the bottom, 6 on top, and we split it in half. Now let's multiply. 6 times 5 is 30, and add the two zeros. 6 times 2 is 12, and add the zero at the end. And 6 times 7 is 42. 30 times 500, 3 times 5 is 15, and add the zeros. 30 times 20, that's 600. And 3 times 7 is 21, and add the 0 at the end. Alright, so let's now do our standard algorithm. 7 times 6 is 42. 2 times 6 is 12, plus 4 is 16. And 5, plus, 5 times 6 is 30, plus 1 is 31. Now let's look at the top half of our area model. 3,000 plus 120 plus 42 equals 3,162. So this number is equal to our number here on our standard algorithm multiplication. So that makes the first part of our area model. Now let's continue on multiplying. Add a zero at the end. Seven times three is 21. Two times three is six plus two is eight. And five times three is 15. 
Well, 15,000 plus 600 is 15,600, but then plus 210, that's 15,810. So this number is equal to the number over here. So that's the, part, the bottom part of our area model. Now let's add. 2 plus 0 is 2. 6 plus 1 is 7. 1 plus 8 is 9. 3 plus 5 is 8. And 1 is just 1. So our answer would be 18,972. And we'll also circle our answer. Yeah. Alright, now next page. Route 2. Solve using the standard algorithm. A, we have 649 times 53. 9 times 3 is 27. 4 times 3 is 12, plus 2 is 14. And 6 times 3 is 18, plus 1 is 19. Now add a 0 at the end. 9 times 5 is 45. 4 times 5 is 20, plus 4 is 24, and 6 times 5 is 30, plus 2 is 32. Let's add 7 plus 0 is 7, that's 9, 13, 4, and 3. So 34,397. Let's look at B now. We have 400. 96 times 53. Let's look at the 3. 6 times 3 is 18. 9 times 3 is 27, plus 1 is 28. And 4 times 3 is 12, but plus 2 is 14. I'll add a 0. Let's look at the 5. 6 times 5 is 30. 9 times 5 is 45, plus 3 is 48. And then 4 times 5 is 20, plus 4 is 24. Let's add 8 plus 0 is 8. 8 plus 0 is also 8. 4 plus 8 is 12. 4, 5, 6, and then 2. So 26,288. Alright, now let's look at C. 758 times 46. 8 times 6 is um, 48. 5 times 6 is 30 plus Four is 34. 7 times 6 is 42, plus 3 is 45. Add a 0. 8 times 4 is 32. 5 times 4 is 20, plus 3 is 23. 7 times 4 is 28, plus 2 is 30. Let's add 34,868. Alright, and now let's look at D. 529 times 48. 9 times 8 is 72. 2 times 8 is 16. Plus um, 7 is 23. 5 times 8 is 40. Plus 2 is 42. Add a 0. 9 times 4 is 36. 2 times 4 is 8. Plus 3 is 11. And 5 times 4 is 20, plus 1 is 21. So let's add 2 plus 0 is 2, 3 plus 6, um, 3 plus 6 is 9, 2 plus 1 is 3, that's 5, and that's 2. So 25,392. Alright, now number 3. Each of the 25 students in Mr. McDonald's class sold 16 raffle tickets. If each ticket costs fifteen dollars, how much money did Mr. McDonald's class raise? Students raise. All right, so twenty-five students and each sold sixteen raffle tickets. Now we know the price of each ticket, but the first thing we need to do is how many total raffle tickets did they sell? Twenty-five times sixteen. Five times six is thirty. Two times six is twelve. Plus three is fifteen. Add a 0, 5 times 1 is 5, 2 times 1 is 2. Now let's add. We have 0, 10, and 4. So 400 raffle tickets. But we're not done yet. Each costs $15. So if we do 400 times 15, that's equal to 4 times 
times 15, but then times 100, since we're taking away 100 from, since we divide 400 by 100. 4 times 15 is 60, and now times 100, that's just 6, and then add the zeros. So that's 6,000. So Mr. McDonald students raised $6,000. All right, number four. Jason buys a car and pays by installments. Each installment is six is five hundred sixty seven dollars per month. After forty eight months, Jason owes one thousand two hundred fifty. What was the total price of the vehicle? Five hundred sixty seven times forty eight. Seven times eight is fifty six. Six times eight is forty eight plus five is fifty three. Five times eight is 40 plus 5 is 45. Add a 0. 7 times 4 is 28. 6 times 4 is 24. Plus 2 is 26. And 5 times 4 is 20. But then plus 2 is 22. Now let's add 6, 11, 12, 13, 17, 27,216. But we're not done yet, she, like, because Jason still owes 1,250. So 27,216 plus 1,250. That's 6, 6, 4, 8, 2. 28,466. That means the total price is... $28,466. So yeah. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps. And please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps on my channel. See you guys next time. Bye!